I, I see so many people, the, the second biggest excuse that I get, and I call them all excuses. The second biggest excuse that I get right now is, well, I don't have a media team to follow me around like you did. You're right. You don't have a media team to follow me or follow you around like I had. That is correct. And I think a lot of people are so wrapped up on this. Well, the video has to look perfect. And, and why would I do anything that's less? It doesn't look professional if I just do it on my webcam, sitting in my room with my printer behind me and a chair over here. It does. Because people aren't looking at your surroundings. They're looking at you and they're listening to your message. And so my advice to you is just do it. Take four minutes out of your day mm -hmm. and make a video. I'm going to give you one thing that you can do right now. So this is something that it's, it's not automation, but it's going to help you in the future. Okay. And this is something you can do right this second that is going to help your business down the road because it's going to be something that you can do that people are going to remember you by that are going to start putting two and two together. I had a series it was called Spotlight on Tri-Cities. And we went around to all these restaurants and we interviewed them. We went around to all these businesses and we interviewed them. We made our videos about them. We were in them. We were there. Hello. Everybody knew that we did real estate because we talked about real estate in them. But we focused the video on them. You don't have to do the same thing. You can do the same thing, but you don't have to. What you can do today is you can go on and you can go into your area and you can create a Facebook group for restaurants that are open and have takeout and delivery available during COVID-19. That's the first thing you can do right now. Go create a Facebook group, call it food to go in your area during COVID-19. I know four guys that have done this since our webinar yesterday. And they are in the tens of thousands of users in it. Uh, ben, for example, Ben's at like 17,000 people. He got interviewed by the news. Yeah, dude, it's nuts. Now you're like, well, how am I going to turn that into business in the future? You can turn that into business in the future. You're now building trust with people by showing, look, even during this time of crisis, we're out here. We're helping you. We're helping businesses do better. Those businesses are going to remember you. Thank you.